So here we go then, part two of the Dream semi-final, history chasing Manchester City against the 14-time European champions, Real Madrid. The players out into a colourful cauldron of noise. It's a season-defining night for everyone down there. as Europe's top team tonight. It's a night where careers can be defined, epitaphs written. It's a night for players to flourish under pressure and the road paved in... Akanji. Gundogan. Walker's going to shoot. Hasn't scored a goal in this competition for almost two years and he's way off target with that one the England right back but of course we saw in the first leg Steve just how important his role is going to be tonight yeah. against Vinicius Junior you can get into him very very quickly here's Walker Kevin De Bruyne who is going to be able to play it back here towards Bernardo Silva that's good defending though by Tony Crows. nice and measured inside his own penalty area but it's a dangerous ball that by Vinicius Junior and Manchester City quickly back in possession. A dominant start in terms of possession here for Manchester City. And those twinkling feet of Bernardo Silva getting to work. Camavinga with his work cut out on this side. Tony Kroos in there to help him. And now it's with the experienced Alaba. And the free kick, I think, here is going to be given to Real Madrid. Yeah, Bernardo. To Silva took umbrage with Tony Kroos, but to be honest, I think the tackle was okay. It was from Vinicius Junior on Bernardo Silva. Simon Martiniak thinks he wins the wins the ball. The winners of tonight's match in the final on the 10th of June in Istanbul. Here's De Bruyne. On oh, it goes to Haaland. Great chance for Manchester City. Pulled back and nobody was there. It was just the touch that took him to make the run into the penalty area. Here's Bernardo Silva, Kyle Walker, Rodri, onto that right foot, opens up the space, all the way through and wide. Oh. It's been such a good start here for City. A number of issues, I thought Rodri was going to hit the same type of shot that he scored against, against Bayern Munich here, opens up on your left foot, now he goes right. Looking to try and slip it in here to Gundogan, who's got the possession, and they've got Haaland and De Bruyne hovering in the middle. It's a well-organised Madrid defence at the moment. Stones with the long-range shot, always drifting wide. That might be the option for Manchester City in the early going and the applause from the manager. Yeah, it certainly is the option. It happened last week in the early stages. Well, and Bernardo Silva. Akanji. Grealish. Lifted into... Oh, it's all what a stop! Courtois! And then David Alaba with a clearance. How on earth was that? Not 1 0. Outstanding ball in, and I think everybody inside the stadium. To Bernardo Silva. Slightly different angle. Good delivery towards the far side of the Kanji. Oh, and goal! What a save! What a save! That is absolutely world class from Courtois. What more can you say? It's going one way. Here's Walker, and now De Bruyne, and they're toying with them. Bernardo Silva! Yeah! Yeah! him away from Kroos, here's Gundogan. Haaland with the shot! Oh! I thought that was going to rip into the top corner of the goal. It's the hardest one of the lot. I tell you, off, ca off camera when you see the pass as well. 
Every City player so comfortable on the ball and so confident as well. Grealish gliding, gliding away, and gliding through and running and trying to play Haaland in. That was wonderful play at the outset. From They're still in the game, 1 0 is fine for them. They, they've done this many times before. We saw it at Anfield. Here's the first chance now for Vinicius to get the other side of Walker. Walker's closing speed is so impressive. What a run, what pace, outstanding. It's a treat here by Vinicius Jr. Now carrying Benzema. Tony Kroos with a lot of power. Tony Kroos rattles the crossbar. What a hit from Tony Kroos. Movement, pace. I can't say accuracy because it's the bar. But he catches hold of that and has lost. Grealish for Manchester City. Gundogan stepping in. There's the chance. Oh, it's two. It's two. And it's the ball silver again. Manchester City can see Istanbul appearing on the horizon. And little Bernardo Silva is the man who's driving them there. Yeah, accompanied by Jack Grealish, it was brilliant again there. Madrid giving the ball away and rightly being punished by Manchester City yet again. The two gods to give the ball. Rodri. Here's Bernardo Silva. He's going to shoot Bernardo Silva. Bernardo Silva to Kevin De Bruyne, and the little fingertip from Courtois, it's Gundogan, it's Haaland, <laughs> it's Akanji with the shot, it's cleared behind by Alaba. They are all over the place round the trip. Oh, my word. At will, you have a shot, I'll have a shot, you have a shot. Towards Stones, punched away by Courtois, and there's half-time, and listen to the cheer, Guardiola stalks off. Delighted by what he's seen. Real Madrid at six and sevens, ripped apart. Bernardo Silva with two goals. The first one with his feet, the second one with his head. I've seen yeah, from Real Madrid. I think so. When we talk about who did what happened last week, three man city wall. Oliver does hit one. Oh, he's had to save it. What a hit. And what a save from Edison. Absolutely wonderful strike from Oliver. A great strike. Like I said, sublime. Supremely accurate, the movement was outstanding. They were never really hurried when they were in possession. Grealish now slipping away from Carvajal, straight forward, yellow card. Grealish is another one who's winning his individual battle out there. Here's De Bruyne, who's been all over the field, as always, for Manchester City tonight. Whatever the opposition, whatever the occasion, he plays his game, and he's away from Camavinga. And he almost played it to Gundogan, he's got it! Carvajal, though, took it off him. Positive one. For Pep Guardiola's team, every tick, every minute that passes takes them nearer to the final. All the emphasis here on Real Madrid to score the next goal. Gundogan just missed Bernardo Silva, cleared away by Benzema's touch, letting him down. That's a lovely flick. Bernardo Silva to Kevin De Bruyne. He can power on. It's good tracking though in there by Camavinga. Good midfield play by the young Frenchman. Such a flex, Rodri. This is all they need to do. Team in Sky Blue, just keep the ball. Right in the land in the back heel. Haaland's in! Oh, what a save again by Courtois. Haaland can't believe it. He thought that was number 53. Gundogan uh, may well get the chance to lead out Manchester City in the Champions League final in Istanbul. That's a foul by Kamavinga on uh, Jack Grealish. Free kick taken by De Bruyne, oh, yes. it's gone in! It's an own goal, is it? Oh, did Akenji get the last touch? It's a Matt Fletch, 3 0. As Charlie and Lescott says, it doesn't matter because that must be the moment to take Manchester City to Istanbul. Eder Militao couldn't keep it out. Manchester City get the third goal on the night. They've got a three goal cushion on aggregate and even Real Madrid. First, Steve, they've never played into Milan in a oh, competitive game before, so. What a place to do it for the first time. Here's Vinicius, though, trying to get the other side. Benzema now coming in, and the goalkeeper, despite being on the ground, got the touch. Lucas Vasquez plays it back. Brilliant. Foden. On it goes to Alvarez! <laughs> Man 
Manchester City are heading to Istanbul. They will play in the Champions League final against Internazionale of Milan and they've absolutely ripped Real Madrid apart. 4-0 tonight, 5-1 on aggregate and the gap between these two teams is so, so wide. A yeah, fantastic goal from the Champions League final. And that's it. Manchester City have done it. A warm embrace between two brilliant managers. They will go to Istanbul and they could well make history there. The champions are out and the blue moon shines brighter than ever over the Etihad Stadium tonight.